Creekside on Bartown offers community and fun for all of its residents, whether that's hosting Super Bowl parties or heading out for a night on the town. Joining us with all the good fun that they're getting into this month is Life Enrichment Director Kelsey Davis. Kelsey, always great to see you. Always right? Great to see you. Yeah, I know it's been like a crazy two months for you. Yes. It has to be, right? Beginning yes. with, of course, everybody just celebrated Super Bowl with their Super mm -hmm. Bowl parties. But back it up a little bit. You guys were celebrating with the NFL playoffs. Yes. Yes. And former Steeler players, not at <laughs> Creekside, but we, you celebrated them. We have a Steeler. Are player. you serious? Yes. I didn't know that. Yes, Fringy Fuqua from the Steelers. He's right there. There he is. Mr. Right? He is one of our party happy residents. There's Mr. T. Oh we my did goodness. A, a QB toss where we uh, had them stand back and throw it into an inflatable. Yeah. And. Um, this was for the playoffs, right? Yes. It was Fun. For the, like, well, the, well, we well did if you the have him there, party. yeah, it's yeah. like I feel like you have like your own like on-campus analyst. He, right? Yeah, yeah. The ins and outs of everything that's happening with the playoffs to the Super Bowl. Yeah, it was really oh, fun. Wow. Talking with him after yeah. every game. That had to be great. Yeah. Right. And I bet he loves talking about it too. Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. He will talk football anytime <laughs> you want to talk football, and he's got a lot of really cool stories. You know, the immaculate reception and oh all of God. these. Really, he played with Terry Bradshaw and Franco say, He Harris. played with the Steelers when the Steelers yeah. were the yeah. He won. He won team. two Super Bowls with them. So he's He's got rings and right. He's cool. He's cool dude. And he likes to party. That elevated the Super Bowl party <laughs> this weekend, didn't it? Yeah, but yeah. he was trying to do the QB toss, and I was like, Frenchie, you mm. ain't winning. I said, yeah. you're catching that ball. You're not a QB. You ain't throwing that right. ball. And he actually didn't win. So he didn't win. <laughs> I was like, Frenchie, I told you. So just, just had the Super Bowl celebration, taking down the decorations and getting mm. ready for Mardi yes. Gras today. Stayed after work to get ready oh, for Mardi gosh. Gras. Yeah. What are we you guys doing for that? Hurricanes, king cake, beignets, <laughs> all the party, seafood boys. Oh, fun. Yeah. That's going to yeah. be a great, great time. Yeah. And then, you know, could we cram any more holidays right together so you can decorate again <sighs> yeah, for well, Valentine's Day? Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, y'all, y'all got a little bit of hearts around the building because we have the Assumption volunteers Perfect. from Assumption High School. So yeah. I was like, here's all my decorations. Go crazy. Mm -hmm. Act like this is your house. Put it wherever you want to put it. So That's they did great. that for me, which was great. Well, you, you mentioned um, the two interns that you have from Assumption yes. High School. Tell us about that. And we actually and have four, four from four? Assumption. Oh, my gosh. Yes. And what are they going to be doing? They just help out with activities. They help out however however we need help, you know, yeah. sitting around talking with them, doing mails and um, decorating and yeah. just having a good time do, helping out with exercise and anything that's fun. And then I have my two interns from U of L from yeah. the art therapy program. So that's been a lot of fun too. That's so, so helpful too. Oh, for sure. Right. Especially with all of these parties that I'm trying to throw. <laughs> <laughs> because with every party, you have the opportunity to bring art therapy into yeah. it as a learning and a memory experience. Yeah. yeah. And it's just so cool it's to cool. have the art therapist because you know, I can do my own little sit downs of like getting on their mental health level yeah. and, and all of that. But um, having multiple of them at, yeah. that can actually help me out so that I'm able to do some of the other big things that I've got to do while they're able to like get on the level of mental health and, yeah. and reminiscing and having those deep conversations that, oh you know, God. they don't usually get into deep conversations. It's very superficial, you know, throughout yeah. the day, so. And to have that, and I mean, it helps with healing too. You don't know mm -hmm. what what they're going through oh, or sure. what depression or, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I think we all need to have that to remember Absolutely. to talk. Absolutely, and I mean, yeah. they're getting to the age where their families are passing away, yeah. their friends their are friends all passing are. away, yes. and so important to have someone who can take care of their mental health i yeah. mean even just sitting by their bed sometimes because they don't want to get out and do anything well right. okay we can sit down and have a conversation and so. i think too back to the the volunteers from assumption high school that is if any of them are thinking about therapy in any way yes. right like what yes. a great learning experience yeah. that is for them to see everything the totality of what mm -hmm. you do there that it's not just planning events that it is therapy oh, that there's sure. all these elements to this job yeah and we get them involved in other things like the administrative side yeah. so they can kind of dabble in a little bit yeah. Of everything. I mean, they can help out in the kitchen. They can help out in activities. They can help file things mm -hmm. and 
there's a lot of opportunities to volunteer at Creekside. Right, I was going to say, do you need more volunteers? volunteers? You're always taking yeah. volunteers. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. All right, and people can certainly always stop by. You have an open door, yes. we'll just stop by and check stop them by. out as well. Pet a few dogs, <laughs> talk to some, <laughs> some old folks. All right, Kelsey, always great to see you. <laughs> Thanks so much. Uh, to learn a little bit more about Creekside on Bardstown and everything they have to offer or to visit their campus, go first to their website, creeksideonbardstown.com.